Hi, watch fans. This is Jenna at Swiss Watch Expo, and today I have the beautiful 4936G from Patek Philippe. Now, this is going to feature their in-house annual calendar complication movement that they patented in 1996, still used today because it's such a solid workhorse. And I'm going to show you how to wind and set this piece. And as many of you know, annual calendars you only have to set once a year. But just in case you don't keep it in a winder or it's not wound properly, you will need to know how to reset this piece. Stay tuned. All right, so we have this Patek Philippe 4936G. And this is going to be in a really great size. It's coming in at 37 millimeters, so it's great for men or women. We're going to have this gorgeous um, Tahitian Mother of Pearl dial here. And what's great about Patek Philippe is they offer so many different colored straps and materials that you can change. This one has this beautiful neutral colored strap, but you can always get any of these colors to pick up on from the dial. We're also going to have this Pave Diamond bezel. Our case is going to be white gold. Um, on the back, you've got this beautiful skeleton back that really shows off the craftsmanship of the movement. And then what I've noticed from a lot of people is that they are a little bit skeptical, a little nervous to wind and set these watches. But one of the great things is with Patek Philippe, you get the best craftsmanship. So today I'm going to go over how to easily wind and set this piece. Um, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to pull out the crown and we're going to give it our normal um, about 30 to 40 winds just to just to get it going here. Then we are going to set the time to 630 a.m. So in order to get a.m., as many people know, you're going to just keep winding the watch until you see the date move. And that means that you're going to be in a.m. So once we get to 630 a.m., you expert we are going to pull the crown all the way out. And then we've got a pusher here. Uh, if you don't have a pusher, a toothpick works great because it's a very soft material and it won't harm the gold. Um, so in order to move our day of the week here, very simple, you've got a little pusher right here. You're just gonna go until it gets to the proper day. And then on this side over here, we're gonna move the month. Just go over here until it gets to the proper month. And then for our date wheel, it's going to be right down here. You can easily adjust the date. And then for our moon phase, it's going to be our last pusher over here. And it's a little bit difficult to know exactly what phase the moon is in. Um, a lot of us aren't astrologists, but Patek Philippe has a fantastic guide on their website um, that you can easily look up what phase the moon's in and set it there. Drop a comment below and let us know what you think of this watch. 